The stocks is crashing, blocks is clashing, crooked ass cops harassing, stop and ask yourself, how you getting money in the middle of a war? It's easy, believe me, Bush showed us before, that's when I had a 44, a hatchback Ford and a couple thousand worth of 10s and 20s in the drawer, yeah, now I'm about to get my raps to pop, but I ain't gotta change my raps to pop, it's all real shit, I'm underground like Fraggle Rock, concealed with banana clips, take one slip and I'ma peel this, still stick to the script that I believe in, now my pockets poking out like double D cleavage. <laughs> Turf economist, I'm trying to get at least six numbers after the first comma. Derek G the chips. I don't need a bitch. My hustle is my lady. You trying to get to my heart, then pay me. The hustler's thing. It's on me. It's on me. It's on me. Yeah. 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 It's on me. It's on me. Take the pressures of the world on your back, baby. Don't you see? It's on me. Nah, this ain't a freestyle. It's on me. It's on me. Clever business man once yeah. told me. It don't mean shit till you write it down anyway. <laughs> yeah, listen. Yeah. Yeah. The outlook, the outlook on the album, man, is uh, very community oriented. Can you, uh, do you have your own opinion of what the difference is between being wealthy and being rich? I do, actually. My own opinion. I mean, being wealthy. Everybody know what wealth is. I mean, now actually, everybody don't know what wealth is. For those who don't know. From my perspective of what I think wealth is compared to being rich. Rich is something that could be here today, gone tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? It's not hard to get rich. Anybody can get rich. You probably ask half of the bums on the street right now, and they'd probably tell you they half of them used to be rich. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. They used to have this, they used to have that, then it's gone. Wealth is something, you know what I mean, that stay around for a while. That's what we're trying to do. We're trying to build something that got it's gonna have some equity, you know what I'm saying? Something that's gonna have some, it's gonna have, it's not just gonna be worth something today, you know what I mean? But that's my, that's how I would decipher between the both of those. Right, it has, some, it has longevity. Exactly. So what inspires you to put pen to paper in the morning, man? Is it the cognac and the oatmeal or what? <laughs> <laughs> nah, not all the time, man. Just really, I really need to rap though. Like I really, I didn't realize it when I was young. It's something that I just picked up on when I was young, you know what I'm saying? And I just did it on my spare time because it was fun and it still is, but like without me doing that, that's like my chance to vent, you know what I'm saying? Like, even if I'm going in there and talking about just having fun, like, you know what I mean? Like, that's how I'm feeling at the time. I don't know other other way to really express it other than to write my raps and go in the studio and record it. Like, that, that's what feel the best to me, you feel mm -hmm. me? Is there any uh, particular track off this album that was inspired by one particular incident or one you pulled one particular incident you really just like fired it all into one into one I song. think I'm not even really sure I don't think I don't really make my songs like that so it's hard for me to say that like I really take a collection of incidents that I've been through my brother people around me and I kind of try to put them all together into one you know what I'm saying I'm Every now and again, I may make a song that's just straight inspired by one incident, but it's hard. That's hard for me to do that. I, I got so many ideas that I can't really just put one idea into a song. You know what I'm saying? It kind of got to have layers to it where I can relate to it and so many other people can too. You know what I mean? For like 30 minutes, and I start with the ingredients. First, I get a cup of rock Kim, then another cup of Scarface. Quarter stick of Tupac, two zips of raw base, tablespoon of chicken.